Hey, it's time to update you on my FGC9 project. The printing is done. Uh, most of the assembly is done. I'm down to rifling the barrel. That is all that is left. Getting the mandrel to print properly was my biggest obstacle. I you know, had what appeared to be really good prints, but I just could not get that wire to thread through the through the slots. And I know a lot of people put the wire on and press it in with a screwdriver, but when I did that, it just left the wire mangled. Uh, I mean, it worked. I got I got them in the notches, but it was it was banged up looking, and I was concerned that that would really impact the quality of the rifling. So I was just determined to get it to thread. So what I ended up doing was printing it uh, with a .2 nozzle and on a much slower speed. I think my outside speed was tw was 25 and my infill speed was 40, I think, uh, with a .2 nozzle and in PLA, and that worked. And I adjusted the model to increase the thickness of these fingers because they tend to snap off when I'm working with it. I, I get a little heavy-handed and squeeze too hard. Uh, so I thickened these. And uh, anyway, it, it printed pretty well. I still had trouble getting the copper wire to thread easily and then it occurred to me that I had something already in-house that would probably work better. Um, the welding wire from this project is slightly smaller in diameter and much, much stiffer and I was able to work it through. It still took some effort, but I was able to work it through, and that, boy, it made a lot of difference. When I had trouble getting it to thread, when I hit a point where it wouldn't thread, I took the back edge of a razor blade, put it in the notch, and worked it. Just, you know, carefully worked it back and forth, you know, without slicing myself. And then I also took some 400 grit sandpaper, folded it over, put it in the notch. And worked it back and forth and that made a huge difference I was able to get them all threaded pretty quickly and uh, unfortunately with the welding wire it's a lot stiffer it doesn't bend very well uh, so I was I was going to have difficulty joining all these six wires so I took the copper wire wrapped it and then soldered it so I have a nice nice connection there so this mandrel is ready to go I'm ready to rifle that bugger. Thank you.